it's me, Alex, and everyone's favourite bird, Archie! <laughs> something lately. It seems as though if you ask then you shall receive because so many people left comments on my haul videos asking me to do a Zarful haul and then what turned up in my inbox? None other than an email from Zarful. <laughs> they said to me that I could choose some products and I could have them for free and all I had to do is a review video. So I took to Instagram and I said to everyone, hey guys, Zaffle's giving me some stuff, what do you want me to review? So this is another Yoweebi, you wanted it, I bought it. You can either check my Instagram or you can check my Twitter and there's almost always a Yoweebi happening. Now what I've come to learn is that there's a very, very big misconception about products from China. People are always quite hesitant because they're worried that the products aren't gonna fit the way that they do on the website. But so far, I've found that AliExpress, Romwe, and Shein, and even Wish to an extent, have all had really consistent sizing and every product that I've ordered has been really good. Five minutes later. This just fits atrociously. Now, the thing that I always suggest is check the size chart and check the reviews. If the website does offer reviews, like AliExpress for example, it's really, really important to check them because if a product's been listed and there's no reviews, I would be a little bit more hesitant to buy it. But if other people have reviewed it, that's almost always a guaranteed safe bet. So, so far, I've been really happy with absolutely everything that I've ordered from these websites. And what I always try to do is order the exact size that I should fit. So usually people say, oh, if you're buying from China, make sure you size up or you size down. What I like to do for the sake of these reviews is buy my actual size and then see how it actually fits. And in the Romwe video and the Shein video and even the Wish video, all of them, things fitted me exactly. So if I ordered a small, the thing fitted me as a size six, as an Australian small, it fitted me perfectly. So I've had really good experience, but that doesn't mean that everyone's gonna have a really good experience because everyone does have different body shapes and stuff like that. So just check the size chart to be sure. But these days I buy stuff with confidence because I was always really hesitant about those websites, but everything that I've got so far has been really, really good. So I've been really happy. So with that out of the way, let's open up this package. Now I think that they gave me a $100 budget from memory. So everything that you see here, I got all of these things for just $100. So it's pretty cheap. By the way, the top that I'm wearing is from Romwe and this is from Shein. And both of these things I've been really, really happy with. I love both of them. Okay, let's get into it. Right off the bat, I'm really impressed because all these things are in this sort of really cool, nice plastic Ziploc bag that has Zaffle written on the side. So I really like attention to detail and I feel like that's a really nice added touch. Another good thing was that everything came in the one parcel. So when I did my wrong wee haul, I got seven parcels. All of that stuff came at, at different times and it seemed to come from different locations because there were different stamps on them. But this all came in the one parcel, so I really like that. So it seems as though it's all coming from the same factory and there must be some sort of, it must be regulated, you know, there must be quality control and stuff like that because they, they're wrapped, they're branded, everything. So I think that's a really good start. Does this keep going out of focus? Okay, so the first thing is a strapless top. Now, this one, it does have some straps that came with it. Can you hold those for me? The material is really stretchy, and I really like the color too. I feel like this is going to be very flattering. Oh, and the strap, oh, I see, I see. The strap is to lace it up. So you're meant to, oh, that is gonna, oh, that's gonna be so annoying to do up. Damn it. Okay, well, I'm gonna need that back. No, no, I need it. No, you have to let go. It's not a toy. It's mine. What are you doing? What are you doing? Da, da, da. The next item, what is this one? I can't remember. Oh, this is a really pretty dress. So this one, wait, what is it? What? Oh, <laughs> okay. So this dress has buttons all the way down the front and then I'm pretty sure that you have to tie it. 
here. Yeah, there's a little ribbon that you tie at the front. Now, I know that doesn't really make very much sense, but you'll see when I put it on. But straight away, the fabric is really nice. Like, it feels really lovely. It feels very thick, very well made. There's no loose stitches or anything like that. There's no marks or scuffs or loose stitches or anything. So I'm really excited by that. I think the quality of that is really good. Well, I'm just the tiniest bit confused about this one because I'm not really sure how it's meant to tie up. In the picture, it shows this really cute sort of like bow knot thing, but I'm not a Girl Scout and I'm not really sure how to do that. So I'm just going to kind of leave it like that for now. But this is a lovely dress. I'm very happy with it. I think that it's very, very flattering. I really like the way that it sits off the shoulder. And I think that the length of it is really nice too. Now I just have to work out how I can show you how long it is. Archie, can you sit on the ring light? Sit there. Yeah. Okay, so there it is full length. I think this is really lovely. I like how it kind of tucks in here. This is made so nicely. Like, I'm really, really impressed by the quality of this fabric. The only thing is, I haven't got a clue how to do it up. Here it is from the back. It does kind of have a funny shape here, but that's not such an issue. I love the colour and this also came in black and green as well as blue. So, loving this one. So many people suggested this next one. I think I had about a hundred DMs suggesting this, and it's because in a previous video of mine, I had mentioned that I don't have very much yellow. I just have, I just have those two things, and that's all the yellow that I have. So I had said I really need to buy more yellow, and now trust my loyal followers. They're holding me accountable. They were like, Alex, you got to buy this because it's yellow. <laughs> so this one is a gingham, 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 gingham. I don't know. Gingham. Dress. So it ties up at the back, and this is it from the front. It's got these really cute buttons all the way down the front. This is very thin. Like, I can see that this kind of almost feels like a... Uh, oh, what, hmm, what does this feel like? Almost like... Like a very, very thin, cheap tablecloth. <laughs> That's... I feel like this is the sort of fabric that you would buy to go on a picnic. Like a very cheap tablecloth fabric. But that's okay, as long as it looks really nice on, I don't mind. Okay, I do love the look of this one. I think that the yellow suits my complexion. I like the length of it. It's tiny, like a little tiny bit short, but I don't think it matters too much. The back of it is really sweet too. I love how it does up. The buttons are very nice. They're not real buttons, obviously. They're just sewn on for decoration. And I really like how thin the straps are too. The only problem that I have with this is that the material is very, very thin. So you can see my red undies through it. So this is the sort of thing that you would have to wear like nude undies or a G-string just because of how thin it is. But for summer, it is very, very nice. And I think that this is a really cute dress. Okay, I can't remember what this next one is. I have to pull it out to see. Ah, I remember. Okay, this one is a two-piece set. Now this again is very, very thin. This is an off-the-shoulder long sleeve top with a white matching skirt. There it is. Now this is most certainly not going to pass the underwear test. If you've been watching my videos for a little while, you'll know my underwear test is that I wear coloured underwear under things so you guys can visually see like how thick the fabric is. That is not going to pass the underwear test, I can promise you that. Okay, well, here's the white set. I feel like every single online retailer sells this set in some way, shape or form. It's a very, very popular sort of set. But this skirt, I'm not going to turn because my bum is literally hanging out of the skirt. Like, 100% hanging out of the skirt. The skirt is the shortest thing I've ever seen in my life. I guess if I kind of maybe pull it down a bit past my belly button, it kind of works, but yeah, no, no, no. 
This one is a bit of a disaster. And this is so thin that you can't wear any suit of bra. You can't wear a suction bra. You can't wear a normal bra. You can't really wear anything. You just kind of have to wear nipple covers or something. But this one is... I was really excited about this, but this one hasn't worked at all. Maybe if you're a shorter person than me, this one might fit you a lot better, but for five foot nine, I cannot wear this in the slightest. It is so short. It's just, I mean, actually the skirt, I could probably wear the skirt as a top, come to think of it. Let me... Actually, that's better. <laughs> Life hack! The skirt could literally be worn as a top. And actually, I'm not mad. I think I'll wear it like that. That's really cool. I don't mind that at all. This next one, I actually think this might be exactly the same as that previous one. Now this is the only thing that hasn't come in one of those cool Ziploc bags. No, no, not for you. Yeah, this is actually, oh, oh, this is just a top. And this top is identical to the top that I just showed you, except it's pink. So this one was another one that was very, very, very highly suggested by a lot of different people. Okay, so when I first unboxed this one, I actually thought that it was the same as the white one, but it's not. It's actually a lot wider. <laughs> So the white one was like that thin and it didn't cover my bra. This one is a lot wider, so I actually have a suction bra on underneath this. And this is really pretty. I, ad I adore this top. I think it's so sweet. I feel like I'm going to wear this a lot. The material is really nice. It's not transparent or anything. It's very, not too thick that it would be hot, but it is thick, nice material. And uh, just, just for, just for lols. So now I have a really cute two-tone top. Honestly, I feel like such a genius. I'm sorry, Archie. I really, really adore this top. It's got a really nice elastic part. It's got elastic around here and around here, so it actually stays in place really well. I think this is beautiful. I love it. This reminds me of the influencer Joanna Kutcher. She wears a lot of things like this. This was suggested by a few people as well. Drop it. Drop the bag, sir. Okay, this is a two-piece set again. Now that looks very wide. This is a small, but that... I don't know how that's gonna fit me. We'll see. So that's the top. And then this is the skirt. So I'm, I ordered this in a small. It doesn't have any size written on it and there's no tags on the inside either, so I don't know if they've sent a small, but I'll just assume that they have, but it just seems like it's going to be quite big, but I'll give it a go. Okay, so I did manage to find a size tag on this one, and it turns out that it is actually a small. There was a teeny, teeny, tiny little S written on the top, but nothing on the bottom, but this doesn't fit like a small. Like, I can put my arm in there. Archie, stop! Like I said, I can put my arm in there, so this is definitely not sized right in any way at all. Oh no, I'm stuck. Uh, okay, so that's a bit of a shame. And also this, this just fits atrociously. Like, it's really, really baggy. It could just be because I don't have boobs of any sort at all. They're more like indents. But I just don't think that size-wise this one worked. And that's kind of annoying because I was saying at the start that I've been really, really happy with how everything fits. But this one, this has let me down and I'm very sad because I really, really like the set. I think it's really cute. So I might have to do some sort of DIY work on this one. Ooh. Oh, look, this has fallen off. Everything's falling apart. I don't know what's happening. So yeah, that is very unfortunate about this set because I do really love it and I think it's really cute. This is a really cute little crop top and I was very excited about this because I've actually been seeing this popping up on Facebook ads for ages and I really wanted to buy it. 
yeah, it's this little tiny crop top that has Paris embroidered into it. And to be honest, I did actually think that it said pants. I thought that the rose was meant to be a T and I thought it said pants, but it says Paris. And I think that's really sweet. So I'm very excited about that. Okay, well, here's the little Paris crop. I think this is adorable. I definitely recommend this one. I mean, it's, it's really, really easy to wear. It's really light. It's really stretchy. It's really fun. It's exactly what you'd expect. Like it's not, it's not bad quality. It's actually quite nice. And I think that the fit is really perfect too. So I really like this one. I just have to kind of figure out what sort of skirt that I want to wear it with. Whoa. Do you like it? Do you like it? Is it pretty? I think the embroidery is really sweet and I love this little rose. And this is a very, very cheap top and it comes in heaps of different colors too. So I definitely recommend this one. I think I did it wrong. Okay, we got there in the end, kind of. I, I did it wrong. I feel like lacing this up was probably the most difficult thing that I've done all week. I actually really had to test myself. It's been a long time since I had to lace anything up. I mean, usually shoes come with the laces already done up. So that was a little bit annoying. But what I did was I laced it from the bottom so that it would so that it would come up to the top and then the bow would be at the top. And I think this is really cute. I love this top. It's really nice fabric. It's really soft. I thought that it would be scratchy, but it's not. It's actually really lovely. Can you come here? Come here. Stop screaming. Just, just come here and behave. He screams when he's on the window because he's screaming at people on the street, but then he's with me and he's totally fine. So I adore this top. I'm going to wear this a lot. I mean, I know it's winter right now, but I'll still get some wherever. Uh, uh. Can you please not... Uh, okay, well, he's just trying to undress me on camera now. We're a family-friendly channel, bird. Can you please not? I've just paired this one with this cool fake leather skirt that I got from Shein the other day. And I think this is a really cool outfit combination. I feel like I could actually wear this out and be really happy in it. So I definitely recommend this top. So I would say... From this haul, I definitely recommend the off-the-shoulder pink one. I think that's stunning. I would recommend the yellow picnic rug. I think that's really, really nice too. I 110% recommend this one. This is one of the cutest dresses that I've got from a Chinese retailer, like, ever. I love it, and I can't wait until the weather warms up so I can wear it. I can just imagine wearing this with, like, a white hat and white sunglasses and white shoes and feeling all, like beachy and resorty. I love it. I think that's really, really cute. Or I can imagine standing in a field full of daisies wearing this with a straw hat. I feel like it's very versatile. Can't say that I rate the white set. I mean, the top is pretty good, but the skirt was a disaster. The skirt is... <laughs> the skirt is a bit more of a top than a skirt, so I will absolutely use that skirt as a top, and I'll probably feature it in this video that I keep talking about where I'm going to take all the things from my hauls that didn't quite work and I'm going to do some DIY projects with them. So you can expect to see that white skirt in that video. I definitely also recommend the little crop top with Paris on it. Love that. That's such a stunning one. And then this one, I'll kind of leave that up to you to decide because for me and for my body shape, the sizing was a disaster. But the set itself and the way that it's cut and the length of it and the style is absolutely stunning. So it could just be my body shape. Maybe I had to order an extra small in this one instead of a small. But I would just be a little bit careful with the sizing on that. That's the only thing about it that I didn't like. I mean, I love the pattern. I love the style. It's so chic. I really like it. So just be a little bit careful if you're going to order that one. And if you do order it, please send me a message. Please send me a photo and let me know how it goes. I'd love to see. Anyway, guys, that's all that we have for you today. Thank you so much for watching, we really appreciate it. If you liked this video, maybe consider subscribing because we have a lot of other haul videos coming out soon. Maybe also give us a like and hit the notification button and then there's a chance that you might just receive a notification if I post a video. Maybe, if you're lucky. <laughs> if I'm lucky. Thank you so much for watching and we'll see you next time. Mwah!